Hello and welcome to the tutorial. I'm going to be showing you how to create multiple slideshows with WordPress. So to get started here, we have um, installed the A Slideshow plugin. And if you don't already have this plugin installed on your WordPress, you can just uh, make your way over to plugins, add new, and do a search for A Slideshow. Then install it, and you'll be able to come to the um, the admin panel like this, where you'll have a number of options. So um, our images are actually, uh, we're going to have a look here. They're a certain size, so we're going to make the slideshow the same size as our images. And they are 957 by 370. So that's width, 957 by 370. And our time is going to be 300, uh, 3, 3,000 milliseconds. We're going to have the simple theme. Um, we're not going to show the title bar. And we're not going to show the control bar. We're going to have it autoplay. And it's going to fade in between slides. Um, there's a number of other settings here. We're going to remove the big play button. And um, there we go, we're going to save these settings. So now we copy the, the, the code here, and I'm going to take it over to my post here. I'm going to remove um, one of these, as we're not going to need it. And I'm going to add the first image here. So there's our first image and our second image. So there's the uh, the short code there, and um, I'm now going to give the title here, and we're going to publish the page and view the page. And there we go, we have our slideshow. So you can change the, uh, the effect in between the slides, or you can uh, change the transition in between the slides. And you'll notice we're getting a, uh, a white space after the last slide. This is due to um, having the, 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 the line of white space in the code. So what we do, we just simply remove this here because it's detecting uh, blank space update it and we should have a smoother transition now view the page and it goes backwards and forwards so you can add as many images as you like to the slideshow and this is a quick and easy way of adding the slideshow thanks for watching the tutorial and bye for now